Good Sunday morning to you. Casey here, happy to be reporting for Casey Collections and Casey Collections 2. We are going to pop open both stores today from noon until 3. Our typical pattern when we pop open has been more like 11 to 3 when it's a Sunday. But we're going to pop open at noon today because there is an Ironman race coming through town and the streets um, and downtown Buchanan will be blocked off until 11. So just in an attempt to make sure that we don't interfere with any of the race traffic coming through town, again, we are going to open at noon. But you know the story. If the flag is flying at KC Collections 2, then that means we are open and we certainly would love to see you. So again, Casey reporting here. We're going to be open at the main store today, Sunday, June 4th, from noon until 3, again, in an attempt not to interfere with anything going on with the Ironman race that's coming through town. It should be all over and wrapped up with by 12. Therefore, we are going to pop open at KC2, where both stores have been getting new product each and every day. So I don't even know where it's all gotten pushed to in here. We're discovering it together this morning. But KC2 is our outlet type store. We'll kind of see how long, you know, we're able to kind of keep things rolling and open there. But in the meantime, you know, the store got cleaned uh, about over two months ago. And of course, we keep it clean uh, each and every week. But the moral of the story is we decided that we were going to go ahead and just open back up on a pop up opening basis at KC Collections too. So we've got all kinds of closeout linens there. We continue to push new, brand new, never having been in the main store before, new um, home decor items at 2KC2 as well. And if we get down there this morning, I might do another live there just so you can see all kinds of goodies and cutie patooties that are there. So if you're wanting to get out and about today and you didn't quite know what you were going to do, well, surprise, maybe it's that you come to see us. Again, it's kind of a three-hour window today, a little bit lighter. We don't want to interfere with the Ironman race in town and cause any additional traffic, you know, turning into the parking lot that's already kind of... Uh, a little bit congested at times with Family Dollar next door here at the main store. They are closed, I believe, again today. Uh, not trying to be their spokesperson, just simply saying that we do share an entrance and there's been a bit of confusion as people are turning in, thinking they're open and then doing some U-turns, you know, to, to go somewhere else, of course. So what does that mean? We're grateful, you know, for the remodel happening over there. It's going to be great for our community for sure. Uh, but with that being said, if you're coming to see us, the point of all of this is just be careful as you're turning in to the parking lot of KC Collections. So I hope everyone's doing well on this Sunday morning and that you're at least on your second cup of coffee for sure. We continue to push all kinds of new prints into this store, all kinds of new furniture, new home decor, and the list really goes on and on and on. So we'd love to see you, but if you aren't able to come out and you just see something that you cannot live without, remember you can always screenshot it or describe it, you know, send it over in an email to KC Collections with an S, marketing at gmail.com. Give us a call at 540-254-1489. We always change our messages when we are going to pop open. So we will, we will get those message, messages changed in case we're busy and we can't get to it. So again, the, the goal is always to take care of the main store first. So the intention is to be open at KC Collections 2, our outlet version that keeps expanding. It's got a little bit of a showroom theme in the back there where we keep adding new furniture for sure so that anybody that pops in off the street down there that may be a tourist in town that doesn't know about the main store, well, they can get an idea of things that we may have here at the main store, KC Collections. Our hours still remain at the main store, Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays, not until five. So that part hasn't changed, but we are working diligently to pop open as much as possible. And while the floral might look a little ransacked in places, it's still quality, affordable floral. And if you need help putting a, um, an arrangement together, you know, we're always happy to do that. The KCStores.com, we are trying to keep our furniture up to date as far as tables and islands out there. Some great, great buys still for the time being. 
on these uh, Maple Islands. They haven't gone to KC2 or Outlet because, they, frankly, they're too heavy to lift to get there. If you watch yesterday's live, you know there was a ton of sold furniture here and a ton of happy people as the day went on. So it almost all got picked up, and we're always thrilled. When it comes in, the people are grateful and happy and excited to take it home, and, you know, we're always grateful for the business. And then we'll get these blankets up out of here and get you some more frame prints up on the wall so you can see them. This three-piece set here, it's got the TV stand that's 62 inches. It's got kind of the bookcase-type doors with glass on each side. It's normally around $22.45, I believe. We've got it marked down to $1999. It's been here just a little bit. I do want it to go as a three-piece set. We could have sold the side pieces many, many times. The theory is I have another TV stand just like this. So we are trying to push that set out the door just to make more room as we go along. We're working to get all the prints up, so for now it's sort of a hodgepodge, but you can see a little bit of folksy theme there above the mirrors, a different artist that we're bringing in, so we're hoping that you're definitely going to like that. We're also working hard to find log cabin type items, something a little bit different for us, and we will start to work in our collections. They've been this way just for a minute, for sure, as we've been focused on all things rugs. And then all things K2 with the outlet version going on. Back in stock on this cutie island, it's rich tobacco at the bottom and Sealy at the top. Of course, glides on the drawers. Here in the back is a different look for us. We haven't had it before. It's a color called Pewter. Black Knight is the color of the top. Notice that it is just overhang on the back side. And the saddle stools can be purchased separately. So that's a nice island for a space that you don't have a lot of room. So whether you're looking to refresh your tabletop with a new centerpiece, some new runners, whatever the case may be, we continue to try to have a little bit of everything for each kind of home decor. And we are sort of putting the place back together. You can see lots of holes there. We've got plenty to fill it in. Uh, but we, uh, as we have two stores open, uh, meaning uh, the outlet when it is open, it does pull away from here just a little bit as far as being able to keep things maintained. But you guys are always great about definitely understanding that. So what's going on today on Sunday? Well, it's news to me too. So there's an Ironman race coming through town. And what that means is we're just going to try not to interfere with any of that. So we're going to open a little bit later. Um, so we're going to open today as a pop-up opening at noon, not only here at the main store, New Birds, we haven't gotten out yet, uh, but also at KC Collections too. And as long as the team is safe, um, with one of us being down at KC Collections too, and everything's under control here at the main store, then we will keep that store open again, noon until three pop-up opening. The next scheduled Saturday that I know of at KC2, which is our outlet, with, and again, it's a showroom type place for us now, and we'll just go as long as we go with that. Only God knows the answer to how long it'll, it'll be open. But the good news is it's nice to be back in the building and breathing some life in it during this summer travel season. So, you know, it's also a good opportunity as many people are going to flea markets and kind of cleaning out closets, this or that. Well, that's kind of what we're doing. But in addition to that, we are bringing in products specifically for that store. So the next scheduled Saturday that we will be open because that was my intention all along is that we would pop open occasionally on Saturdays at KC Collections 2 will be June 17th. So you can mark your calendar if that's something that you have an interest in. Knowing ahead of time I have an extra staff member that day that I know that, you know, I can kind of slip away or or get someone else to slip away to take care of things there. We have a rudimentary computer system, so it's a little bit tough for, for any of our newer employees uh, and with the items, and I won't even go into it, but it's not the easiest thing in the world, but it doesn't make sense to convert uh, to the newest version of QuickBooks when it's going away in October, and i got to convert the whole store to something else anyway. So with that being said, that's the reason there. June 17th likely will be open on Saturdays. I like to try to open there at 10. So 10 to 3 that day at KC2, June 17th. If you're planning a trip or a day trip or a friend's trip, we see a lot of that, then that's a good time to plan to be able to hit both. Of course, you know here at the main store, upside down trash cans, but they are back in stock. We are open Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays 
uh, let's see, when are we open? Nine until five. Magazine racks back in stock. The yesterday's live certainly showed you all of those, but if you missed it, our two door cabinets, we're trying to a new approach with our economy line of Amish furniture. You know, all of our furniture is real wood, real Amish furniture at affordable prices. But we've tried to set it up um, with Rose back here. So a great idea by one of our senior team members for sure. I think it's making it easier to shop and easier to see. Not everybody's interested in a table in an island and we get that. And so what does that mean? We're working hard, as we promised so many months ago, to continue to bring in lots more of our economy furniture that we kind of ran out of room for um, as the focus during so much of the pandemic was on tables and islands and desks and things for people to be able to, you know, work at home on or they wanted those items because they were home more and they wanted something new and different. The focus has kind of shifted a little bit now away from that, as we see anyway, as we move into these summer months, tables and islands. A brand new table I don't think we've had before with the turn legs. It's just a different look that we wanted to bring in. It's Michael's Cherry Black. It is six foot. It is 42 inches wide. We've got it paired up with the Windsor chairs, a little bit of a classic look, if you will. So we wanted to show you that here in this very back room. Some of our newer prints as well, the red and the blue trucks, great, great detail. And then also some prints from an artist that we've had. She does a lot of bathroom prints, but notice that it looks like she's really broken into a whole different market here with a whole different look. So we're going to see how well you like those um, as time goes on. So whatever you're looking for, real wood furniture, tables, islands, smaller guys, maybe even a blanket chest, can't believe this is still here, or all of the good stuff relates to cabinets and being able to hide them away, or trash bins. Let me tell you, trash bins have been the rage here for the last couple of weeks. It's amazing how things go in kind of like spells, if you will. They go in in patterns. This goes for a while and it, you can't keep it. And then next, before you know it, it's something else that's going that you can't keep. You could see we've added things to our fall display of new items that came in. So if you see it and you like it, grab it because we may or we may not have back stock at this moment. Also, if you're out and about today, it's a great time to visit Miscellaneous. We continue to push in new product there, just 35 minutes north. Smaller store that I own with my mother. It's a smaller store without a furniture focus, but a delightful assortment of home accents that you're not going to quite find just anywhere else. Miscellaneous is open Thursday through Sunday, 10 until 5. So it's a great day. It's a great day to have a great day, and we hope you definitely do that. If you want to come out and see us noon until three at both stores, KC Collections and our pop-up store, KC Collections 2. But always remember that if you go by KC Collections 2 and the flag's flying out front that says open and the door's open, hit those brakes, screech, and come on in. Until we meet again, may you be blessed and enjoy the journey and let's find the good in every day. And let's start each day with a grateful heart. For the KC team, that's the best team on the planet. I'm KC signing off from KC Collections.